Hey guys, what's up? Jason here, and today it is Thursday. It is finally Thanksgiving. I have to start by saying to everybody a happy and warm Thanksgiving from my amazing house to yours. Um, today I'm actually going to be documenting uh, my cooking, and just it's going to be fun. Um, I'm excited. I can't wait to start. I'm actually going to like chill for a little bit this morning and eat breakfast. That way I am pre fully prepared for the freaking task at hand today. So, let's see how it goes. Hey, it's on! The parade is just like every year. You guys aren't going to be able to see it because of the camera. But it's on! Yay! So, I got my knives out of my closet. I get them out every year. I really don't remember if I used them last year, but I dug in there and I finally pulled them out. My awesome freaking knife set that I will open up for you guys later because I can't do it out here. I don't have space, but I received them when I went to culinary arts school and I've literally only used them about like two times, I think, in a professional kitchen. I'm trying to remember all the times that I've used them. Um, but other after that, like I, if I have my own kitchen, I'll use them. But like if when I'm here, I'll put them away because I'm afraid of my grandmother like abusing them or battering them or just they. I don't I don't want anything to happen to them, so I just put them away and then I take them out every year when I cook Thanksgiving. So I am excited. I get to cook with my knives. So I told you guys that I was gonna do my knife set, and here it is. So I'm just gonna do it section by section because this thing is huge. It's Freaking massive. These are my little pockets, like the bottle opener. I have an eighth of a teaspoon. These things are really hard to find. Like something fierce. I don't know. Like anyway, little tasting spoon in there. This is really cute. My awesome freaking measuring spoon. Oh, yes, I love these things. They're magnetic. They stick together. They're freaking awesome. <laughs> Mom, your phone's ringing. Mom, your phone's ringing. <laughs> what is it? Sorry, guys. I don't know. I hear it in the room. Sorry, guys. My grandmother's phone's ringing. And she's just sitting there on the couch. <laughs> Next compartment of different utensils for, like, you know, here's my paring knife. Uh, grandma, uh, I don't even remember, like, I, I remember the word, I just don't know how to pronounce it, and I don't want to sound like an idiot, so I'm just gonna not even worry about it, a zester, uh, apples, you know, just to do different, like, sculptures with fruits and vegetables, like, I, I, I don't remember how to pronounce the word, like I said, but I know, I know what word it is, <laughs> I promise you, I promise you, and that was an awesome shot of my hand, <laughs> next compartment, Next oh, compartment. I don't mess with Frosting I paddle, a big uh, knife. Actually, I'm going to use this to carve the turkey. Uh, serrated knife for bread, uh, my normal knife, my santoku, uh, fillet. Which one's this one? Knife, another knife, just a knife, and then like to, to you know, flip meat over. <laughs> you guys know what that is. Whoever owns a grill, yeah, know what that is. <laughs> and that's my knife set. Yay, knife set! And it all folds up rather neatly, actually. And it has really cool straps that you can like carry it around and just keep it with you. It's so stylish. Oh my goodness, I can't get these shut so I can show you. Ta-da! Alright, so onions are chopped, now I gotta get, what the hell do I have to do now? Uh, I'm making a stuffing, I need apples, the actual freaking stuffing, uh, the, and the chicken bro. This is gonna be fun. I, uh, I don't know if she called you back, but oh, I know she called. <laughs> Woo! Say hi mom! All right, so here's all the stuff. Uh, onions are cut up, apples are cut up. The stuffing's really awesome, actually. My mom came up with this recipe 
Like, and I, she's been making it every year ever since I was born or I could remember. So, uh, unfortunately, the sausage was frozen. My grandmother didn't tell me that the, it was in the freezer. And so now I'm quickly defrosting those, those uh, sausages, the sausage. The sausage. And I am looking for also le walnuts and le crescent. It's going to be awesome. Add some crunch and sweetness to the to the stuff and oh my goodness so good. Yay sausage, browning sausage. Browning the sausage. So excited. This is going to be awesome. You take it out of the casing and you shove it in a pan and you brown it until it's nice and brown. It's still not done yet. <laughs> awesome, thank you. Just I put it there. So Sausage! Here are the onions. If I could actually get them on camera. I'm just letting them saute for a bit in the fat from this. As per my mama. She's the one that told me how to do this. So I'm just letting them saute for a little bit. It's gonna be amazing. That's the pot I'm gonna use. Eventually this is gonna be the stuffing pot. <laughs> That I actually have to start getting ready. Oh my goodness, all right. All right, so I officially have started this. Uh, the stuffing is almost done. The things are already ready. I'm excited. Now I gotta freaking put this bread in here. Our first dog is up right now, the Scottish deer hound. Oh, I think this may be too much. I don't know, you know what? Deer right. deer in stuffing is bread. <laughs> this dog is Chelsea, actually, is the daughter of Hickory, who was best in show at Westminster a couple of years ago. A freaking dog show. Okay. Okay. Now, thank you. I have to go get the turkey. She could get so annoying sometimes. Oh goodness, I'm gonna need two hands. All right, give me two seconds while I put the turkey in the kitchen. Okay, so this is the turkey that I prepped last night. Looks and smells really delicious. 
put some garlic onion powder. There's onions in there, garlic cloves in there. There's bay leaves running around in there somewhere. Uh, oregano, salt, pepper, thyme stuff. You know, good stuff like that. Uh, let me see if I can grab this without burning myself. Uh, all right, so here comes the fun part. <laughs> Stuff this turkey. Let's see, just take it and shove it all up in there. Oh man, this is gonna be so good, Mom. I think it's gonna be better than last year. Well, no, I didn't let the turkey marinate enough last year. This is Nathan. Nathan actually won the Hound Group at Westminster this year and kind of launched a great show year for him. Oldest and most famous, probably, of the set hounds. It's like feeding a giant child. <laughs> Awesome turkey! Thank you, Mom. Yay! Alright, and now for candied yams. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm some little, little batatas. And I'm gonna peel them, chop them up, put them in. Sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes. Ah, yeah, that, what she said. Sweet potatoes. Um, and put it in a nice glass baking dish with marshmallows and brown sugar and butter and just let them bake and be delicious. So, Yay! All right, so all that prep and stuff for the freaking sweet potatoes is done, and now it's awesomeness in the in the in the stove in the oven. Oh, God, goodness, I can't speak. Um, in the oven, yayness. I didn't really measure the brown sugar. I actually like mine were really, like a lot, like really sweet. So I just put a bunch of brown sugar on it with the butter and just shove it in the oven for a little bit. And then later on, I will put on the marshmallows and then let them brown. And then they will be lovely and gooey and awesome. And God, I love it. <laughs> so if the camera would focus. Alrighty, I am boiling some water because I have some potatoes here in the fridge and some water waiting for that water to boil because I'm going to make some nummy nummy mashed titers. But for now, uh, the next thing while all that's going on is going to be the green bean casserole. Um, I read the thing, it says basically just to mix everything together in the bowl and I already prepped it out so I'm just gonna like basically do what it says and just shove everything in the bowl here <laughs> like so I haven't been able to pay attention to this one all day mix this up a little bit Right next to the pepper that I accidentally spilled everywhere. Cutting board's clean, mind you guys, like, I promise you. So 
get whatever left thing. Awesome. All right, so then mixed all that together. Two cans of green beans. Woohoo! Green beans. I don't know. This. I figured this would have like a thicker consistency. I'm really hoping that this like thickens up like when I bake it because this does not look into. <laughs> It's not looking too uh, thick here, so hopefully I wish I had better lighting, like spotlights or something. <laughs> oh no, it looks like green cereal. <laughs> uh, where's the pan? Alright, so pouring in. And now this says it calls for two thirds of a cup of these french fried onions and to be honest with you I actually like a lot of them so I'm just gonna throw them on there until I feel satisfied. So good. This stuff is so freaking good. And it's so easy to make. Like, no joke. Oh. I use, I use the whole thing. Um, this stuff's really easy to make. My hands are clean. I promise you also. <laughs> and done. That's it. Now this goes in the oven for half an hour and done. Alrighty, so in the oven it goes with the yeah with the sweet titers and the and the turkey that I have to really like baste in a couple minutes. All right, so this is what the turkey looks like so far. It's looking really good. It smells really good, and it's really freaking hot in there. I gotta do this quick, and I need both hands. So I'll be back. All right, yay! So I'm still waiting for the water to boil. So I am going to put in motion my pumpkin cheesecakes. I am, I love this recipe. I've actually been making it at least for three, four years now. It's actually from Paula Dean on foodnetwork.com. Spoiler alert. <laughs> and um, I already have the cream cheese beat up here. Oh, I gotta add the puree, the eggs. Hold on. Let me see if I can do this with one hand. Alright, one. Let's see the yolk. Two. All I need to place three dollars. Three. Awesomeness. Oh, it's so good. Alright, so I'm gonna start kneading my hands. Yay, email. Uh, I'm gonna start kneading my hands, so I'm gonna add everything and then I'll be back so I can at least show you what it's gonna look like and try and mix it together. <laughs> Alright, so. Everything's been added. It looks a mess right now. Let me see if I can put it in the light. It looks like a freaking mess. Oh man, this already smells good. I'm mixing it all together. I'm sorry, this is like for such shoddy camera work, guys. Uh, this is what it like. I haven't finished mixing it yet. I have a fork. I don't have a whisk. Uh, let me finish and I'll be back. <laughs> All right, so it's looking a little better now. So these aren't the best looking ones that I've made. Uh, the crust started falling apart, and uh, I also cheated. I used I used store bought crust when she says to make your own, and I'm not gonna go through all that mess considering I still have more to cook. So this is going in her. Yeah, she looks and this one's going in her. And the recipe that I use, I'm actually gonna act, put a link for it for you guys down below in my description box because you guys really have to freaking try this oh. really freaking try it oh man the oven is full oh man and now all I'm missing is the potatoes and to put the marshmallows on the sweet potatoes so yay almost done all right so <laughs> I always forget about those um I kind of skipped ahead because my phone needed to be charged and because I was pressed for time like I needed to actually get stuff done and I actually managed to get stuff done 
Here is the green bean casserole, uh, cheesecake one, cheesecake two. It, these, these didn't come out too well. Don't even pay attention to those. And the rice my, my grandmother's making, and now the potatoes, titers are coming out. <laughs> and the turkey's looking awesome. And just a few more minutes, and it's done. All right. Oh, yay, flash. Why the hell has the flash been all day? Um, probably should have used it. <laughs> All right, well, I've got the things here to make my mashed potatoes. Now, to be honest with you, I don't usually measure. I just make them. I just make them from, you know, memory, just eye it, and to taste. I, I put cheese, onions, I just sauteed some onions and, uh, and bacon to put in there cheese, salt, pepper, white, or, uh, no, sorry, not black pepper, white pepper, I got some nice white pepper for there, some pepper. mustard, uh, mayonnaise, and sour cream, they're gonna be the creamiest, most awesome mashed taters ever, <laughs> yay, here are the potatoes, god, they look so freaking good, and cheesy, and awesomeness, I'm just gonna mess with them, <laughs> I wish I had like four hands to be honest with you like I really do so I could record myself and record what I'm doing and just actually freaking do it and it sucks like I really I need something I need help people but these potatoes are the bomb again they came out awesome I wish everybody was here to try them but unfortunately you're not so you're just gonna have to look at it online and my YouTube channel so that's it I am done. I am officially done. There's the rice that my grandmother made. Uh, I just have everything in the oven. Ta-da. To keep it warm. I turned off the oven, obviously, but everything's still warm in there, so that's what I'm doing with that. And then the cheesecakes are in the fridge. So they're chilling in there. I can't wait to freaking dig into this. It's been crazy hard work all day today. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this freaking video. I know it was crazy. I've never done anything like this before. I've, you know, but I'm trying and this was actually really fun. I love to cook and my glasses are on my face. I, I, the reason why I take them off is because of the glare from either the flash or the light or whatever. It, it, it reflects off my glasses and then it just looks weird and you guys can't see my eyes and then I just look like a weird anime person or a dead person so I don't <laughs> it looks funny um, but yeah so thank you all for watching and enjoy guys happy Thanksgiving oh man I'm stuffed guys that was freaking amazing food I had an awesome day it, I, now I'm just really tired. I'm gonna go take a shower because I just can't no more. I'm about to go to bed. Like it's it's done. It's a wrap. Today is a wrap already officially. I took a picture of the plate that I served myself because as soon as I finished and was able to carve, that was it. Like I just served a plate. There's a picture of the plate on my uh, Tumblr, Instagram, and Facebook. Uh, the links to those will actually be down. In the, in the description box so make sure to follow like subscribe and thank you all again so much for watching now I'm gonna go take a shower and just this is where I'm headed this is this is it this is today's done I'm gonna play some earthbound and just pass pass out <laughs> have an awesome night and so